it and you can see it's got ripples and we're gonna get rid of those by putting it on the disc sander and sanding them out but we're only sanding a fraction of a millimeter and only the convex surface Press more down the table. To the table. And don't press to the disc. Not too much though. And what we're going to do, if you remember, these were 17 and a half in thickness. Each. We're going to get them down to 17 millimeters. Mm. Rather than 17 and a half. So the way uh, white is uh, too wide. Not convenient for our yeah. dimension of the machine. Right. Поэтому вот в таких случаях, In на самом case, деле, да, really. мы как делали, я могу, хотите на одном я покажу сейчас, как я бы это сделал, решил бы эту проблему, вот, я бы, давай, показать, не надо, не пок... надо, он не explain, только, только объясни, не надо показывать, а, тогда на бумаге. Вот. Сикс, да? Шесть. Скажите, разрезаем вот здесь. Кат. Кат. Вот на этой. Вот на. Yeah, on the circular saw. По разметке разрезаем. Потом, вот если вид сбоку взять, вот так вот тут разрезаем. Broadside view. Да, да, вот. Так, потом на этом же. On the same machine. Вот. Сейчас давайте сюда поближе подвигаем. Я опускаю там диск, ну скажем там сантиметр, там это вот около сантиметра. Oh, да? Сантиметр. да? Вот. Устанавливаю. Да? Вот э, так, так, чтобы вот это было половиной. The half. The middle. Да? Вот. И делаю пас. And he makes the channel. Channel. Yes? Да? And from another. И с другой стороны. Part. Another channel. Да. And then fixation. При одной вот установке нельзя с ним сдвигать только, да, чтобы yeah. точность была, чтобы, okay. да, вот, чтобы по одной стороне ориентироваться всегда, когда точишь пазы эти. The same fixation of stopper. Да. Yeah. One. Uh, cut and another cut the same uh, side to press the here mm -hmm. and there is two uh, different cuts and two channels and it is necessary to put inside layer piece of wood a piece of wood yeah to strengthen the joint потом пластину да то есть ну там вот такой же толщины да вот ну Понятно, да? Like the same thickness that the thickness of the blade. Yeah. Склеим вместе. On the uh, glue. Это еще более прочно, чем даже сама она. And отдельно. it will be more да. strength. This is what да. it will be stronger да. than uh, from the да. one part. Да. Единственное, только надо, конечно, это собирать вот по шаблону. Следить, контролировать, чтобы, так сказать, да, все вот это. According with our шаблон. Ну, по, по чертежу. Да? Вот. Оно предварительно вот можно снять это все, конечно. If it is necessary to да. 
insert, insert да. this <coughs> Так, чтобы проходило уже, да, эти две части? Да, просто... Insert this one. It's, it's 80 миллиметров. No way. Mm? Вот. Даже эти не проходят. Видите, вот. It is frozen, too small. Maybe yeah, it yeah. is possible to buy the Chinese Maybe one. Here. Cut here. Boy. Maybe. Maybe. Here. 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 Yes, yes. What? Так, да? И так. Yeah. It doesn't matter. Yeah. Yeah. Does not matter. Yeah. But no better in the middle. Yeah. Because it is very difficult to put the small part of wood here. Вы скажите yeah. так, что когда надо экономить материал, это можно делать изначально, скажем, нижнюю ветвь изготовлять из длинной палки за одной, а эту размечать, ну, экономия, да, получается, две тогда, вот. Пожалуйста, можно так это сразу делать, вот. If the wood is if expensive, да. it is possible to glue two different parts from different woods. For example, it is a wood, use it, uh, this one. Yeah. Put it through the and then yeah. use this one under the angle. Yeah, instead the of cutting one frame with the two same frames. with the same method of connecting. Yeah. Yeah. If so, it's good method. Can we do one now to see? No, next time. Okay. Потому что вот эти планки, которые мы вот сюда собираемся врезать, помните, то, что мы на фото показывали? It is not necessity because we are not making. Это также будет делать. The full set of the same dimension, seventeen. Yeah. It is only the example. Okay. But when I cut this, when I cut this here, this will shrink the wood. Do you understand? When I cut, this will shrink the wood. Distance of wood breaking. And this will no longer. That's why you must. Это учитывается здесь. The shaft. Получается так. Ah, 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 It is more easy than to make such a construction. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Есть еще более простой способ. Когда это делается как? То есть делается, смотрите, в шип. Да, другой путь. Раз, два, да, и прошивается нагелями. Nails, wood nails. Ah, nails. It is official. Glue, glue, glue. And that, как как реальный корабль, да, на самом деле. What is the best way to cut to cut this shape? So that can he? Как вот это вырезать, да? На самом деле. О, это не проблема. Машин. No problem. Distance. Да? Вот он прорезал, да? Получается вот прорезка. And another. Another with this. It's very easy. Very easy. With this machine, yeah, yeah, yeah. Эти машины и хороша, что можно вот так, да, ее эксплуатировать вот. For example, can we do one example on this wood? Is it possible? This is probably bad. Yes, we can. Вот. Так. Maybe on this wood. Maybe on this wood. Тогда если мы скажем так. I'll just use a tissue. Если мы сейчас не будем ее, ну, уменьшать их тогда, здесь 17 с половиной миллиметров. Fold down the blade. Check up the height. Yeah. Then we've got a cut. What we're trying to achieve yeah. is that there. 
how to make yeah. two pieces that lock in perfectly. That's and he's right. used the circular saw to do it. It's correct. And he's raised the saw up three millimeters. So it's come up three millimeters. And you can see that he's measured it using that. Mm -hmm. And then up here, it indicates where my thumb is, Ivan. Up, 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 where my thumb is. Where my thumb is, mate, up. Oh. That says three millimeters up there. Go back down. That's how he's raised it, three millimeters. And on this piece of wood, um, just zoom out so you can see the numbers. Mm -hmm. Three millimeters. Yes, yes. And three millimeters. Yes, 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 yes. So the distance from the number three to the edge is three millimeters, and the distance from there to the edge is three millimeters as well. Okay. Yes. Now we've got to make sure that the this square here is perpendicular to the direction of the blade so we're just using a square to do that uh -huh. he's happy with that now we're putting the wood in with the numbers facing the saw blade And he's cut on the ins inside of the line. Mm -hmm. You can see just on the number five on the inside of the line. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now he's cut the other piece of wood on the inside of the line.
raising the height of the speed. He's happy with that piece. He wasn't previously, that's why he chopped off the ends. Two millimeters? Three. 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 Three millimeters. 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 one of the pieces of wood that's going to be used in the kiln. Yeah, take it out. Oh. These are the pieces he's prepared for the kiln. He's cut that piece of the kiln on the scroll saw. He's just running it through the belt sander. using after sanding that one piece he's drawing the same line on the other piece It's not very good. He's a very modest man. Uh -huh. He's going to keep cutting the length of the piece until it fits in. It's very good. Constant adjustments until it's perfect. Uh -huh. okay. One moment. There is. Now 
now is this kill piece after he's happy with the fit he's putting it in a vise Got his proxon drilling tool. And he's just drilling through that. Alright. And um, once it's been drilled through, he's got some uh, nails. Nails. PVA? PVA. PVA. Uh huh. And he's putting some glue on one surface. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Ah, a lot of glue. A lot of glue. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Bolshoa glue. Oh, yes, yes, yes. He's saying yes, yes. Many, many, many. A lot of glue. Mm -hmm. And he's gluing those together. And then he's putting the nails in. Mm -hmm. Ah, beautiful. Mm -hmm. Yeah, many time, да, no, uh -huh. uh, small time, да, оставляем ее. And here's the completed. Oh keel piece with nails all the way through it. Please. Oh. Okay. Now what is explained is he's gonna have to run this through the thickness of the whole piece because as you can see it's a fraction of a millimeter out there and there's nothing you can do about that. He's saying on this piece of paper 0.05 to 0.1 of a millimeter difference between these two edges. So he's going to run it through the thickness or on both sides so that these sides are then perfectly flush. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, he's explained that um, it's going to go through the thickness so to get rid of that tiny ridge between the two pieces that we've glued. Now when you're constructing the keel you have to allow a bit more thickness on each of these pe uh, pieces for that final sanding when it goes through the machine. So if the keel needs to be a centimetre wide for instance, you'd make the, the pieces slightly wider than that so that when it goes through the thicknesser and you make these two sides equal, you get the final thickness required in the keel. Putting it in. Film his hands, getting it in. How he feeds it. How he feeds it. Get it Just. Ah, ah, uh -huh.
In addition to uh, putting these two sides through the thicknesser, he's also used a chisel to remove the nails that were sticking out, and then he's run that side and also that side through this uh, thicknesser. So all four sides are now perfectly flush. He's now talking about the deck caulking and making this keel join when you've got paper. Aha, aha, aha. Hmm. Aha. Hmm. Aha. Kala was in other, da? Oh. This is the paper he uses for the for the um, caulking. Cool. So he lifted the saw blade up, can you zoom in, three millimetres to cut this one. And now he's measured three millimetres up from the other side. Okay, he said that he's not happy with that particular cut, so he's just uh, going over it with a very, very fine metal brush. It's like sandpaper, one of those metal sandpaper brushes. Hmm? Mm -hmm. Not pilnik. Pilnik. Not, uh, not, not, not pilnik. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. He explained the uh, meaning of that word the other day, not pilnik. That's very fine, that's hardly taking off any wood, just a fraction. So what he's explaining uh -huh. is I'm going to cut on the outside of the line here because uh, if we do cut on the inside we're in big problems. So just on the outside of the line.
Mm. And also a bit of a chisel to to um, get rid of that excess wood. see that there's a bit of a, can you get out of a bit of a hole there mm -hmm. between the two pieces, a bit of a gap. What did that? Can you see that? Mm -hmm. Can you zoom in on that? Yeah. No. Just in there. Mm, yes. So what do you 